As a physician of the eye, how many times have your patients complained that their artificial tears don't relieve their symptoms of dry eye? You've tried every drop under the sun, and they're back wanting a newer, better solution. With the increasing number of symptomatic patients and hype about meibomian gland dysfunction, it's tough to ignore, yet so time-consuming to address. What do you do? Hello, my name is Kandria Krako, and I'm a doctor of optometry in Scottsdale, Arizona. Practicing in one of the dry eye capitals of the nation, I've had more than my fair share of patients with MGD and other closely associated eye conditions such as dry eye, blepharitis, ordeolums, and chalazions. I'm here to talk to you about how I've incorporated an exciting new product into my daily practice, the FDA cleared digital heated iPad made by the Digital Heat Corporation. With the heated iPad, I have successfully created a time and cost effective solution for my patients that I would like to share with you. To begin with, I will discuss what the heated iPad is and how it works. It has the look and design of a futuristic pair of glasses with heat strips to cover the eyes. These digitally heated strips adjust to the shape of your eye and reduce direct, unnecessary pressure to the cornea. Constructed of polycarbonate, the frame is flexible and can handle a fair amount of stress. The heated iPad is easily adjusted at the nose and temples, thus creating an optimal fit for most patients. Once appropriately sized, the device is plugged in and ready for use within seconds. The heated iPad implements localized heat therapy which penetrates the meibomian glands at a much deeper level than your traditional mask. This is key because most warm compresses lose heat to the entire orbit of the eye instead of exclusively targeting and penetrating the meibomian glands. Additionally, the heated iPad is an even, steady source that doesn't cool over time. My favorite feature of the heated iPad is its simplicity and user-friendliness. During the initial engineering period, the Digital Heat Corporation tested and determined a therapeutically effective temperature to warm the eyelids and promote the healthy flow of sebaceous glands. In doing so, the heated iPad was designed with only one temperature setting, thus eliminating the risk of it getting too hot or not being warm enough to be effective. Now let's talk about heat therapy in general. As you're well aware, heat aids in liquefying the solidified oils we see in MGD. There is, however, more to it than just that. When using a proper heat source, such as the heated iPad, the heat supplied to the meibomian glands promotes vasodilation, which in turn increases the supply of oxygen and nutrients to the eyelids. This increase in oxygen and nutrients helps to reduce carbon dioxide and metabolic waste from the eyelid tissue. As you can imagine, this will help the eye combat conditions such as blepharitis, ordeolums, and chalazions. The FDA has cleared the heated iPad with three factors of improved treatment as compared to its predicates. One, heat only where needed. Two, a more precise temperature. And three, constant temperature over time. Now that you understand the technology, I'm going to share with you how I've successfully incorporated the heated iPad into my practice. I first take the time to discuss with my patients what their condition is and how they would benefit from the heat therapy. My practice sells several different forms of heat treatment, so I take a few minutes to discuss their options with the pros and cons of each, the heated iPad being the Ferrari of warm compresses. With the retail price of the heated iPad being spendier than the typical microwavable mask, patients don't always jump at the first chance to purchase it. Because of this, I've introduced an in-office treatment option. This gives the patient a chance to experience the mask and boost start their prescribed heat therapy regimen. The FDA has cleared the heated iPad to be used for five minutes twice a day. However, I choose to use it off-label in office. Our in-office treatment includes a 20-minute application of the heated iPad with gland expression to follow. I charge $45 for the treatment, and if the patient purchases the heated iPad in the same day, I apply a $25 credit towards the purchase of the mask. In most cases, patients are thrilled with the moisture they feel upon finishing the treatment and they end up purchasing it in the same day. When patients present with cordiolums or chalazions, I've also made it a protocol to offer them an in-office treatment. I like being able to distinguish myself offering unique products and services, and this is one of them. And hey, it's something that I'm able to profit from as well. It's a win-win for both myself and the patients. One thing to keep in mind with the in-office treatment is that it's not reimbursable by insurance companies. So be sure to have your patient sign an ABN form. We do, however, bill insurance for the office visit itself. 
when discussing the heated iPad as an option with patients. I also mention alternate heat therapy modalities, specifically Lipiflow and the IPL laser treatment. Though beneficial, these are very expensive options and not reimbursed by insurance. They also require future treatments. I feel that the heated iPad is the best option for my patients not wanting to spend thousands of dollars. Furthermore, if you present the heated iPad with Lipiflow and IPL as the alternative, suddenly it doesn't seem so expensive. Now on a side note, if your practice has Lipiflow or offers the IPL laser, the heated iPad is a great tool for your patients to go home with after treatment. This will promote maintenance and future eye comfort. The product comes with a 30-day guarantee and one-year limited warranty. The digital iCorp is incredibly accommodating at helping you launch the heated iPad and very quick to respond to any questions or concerns. I personally use the heated iPad for advanced MGD and am thrilled with the results. It's hard not to be excited about a product that brings me both personal and professional success at treating eyelid disease. The heated iPad is a perfect complement to any practice at the cutting edge of treating meibomian gland dysfunction and dry eye.